Fin Plus is out and Moen Flow is in at Costco. And the upsets that happened at Flow Logic, Fin, and Moen this past year. But first, this video is brought to you by Moen. And no, Moen isn't sponsoring this video or any of them. I am the only sponsor of this channel, but I did have a great conversation with someone from Moen who reached out to me last year. In prepping for that conversation, I discovered that Costco is now selling Moen Flow. If you're not familiar with Costco and how their model works, they only have one offering, whatever that product is in a particular space. So as a customer, you don't have to worry about decision-making. They've already made that decision for you. You know it's going to be a really good product at a low price point. It's a really easy decision. Also, if you're not familiar, Costco sold Fin Plus a few years ago. One of the reasons for the switch could be this thing called part shortages that started happening from this little thing called COVID. It's just like buying a car where you couldn't get it for a few months because they just didn't have the parts for it. The water monitor industry was not immune from this either. In 2021, you couldn't get Flow by Moen. In 2022, you couldn't get Fin Plus. Everything was on back order. They just didn't have the parts to make the devices. So part of the switch on Costco's website is you can't have something on your website that you can't actually buy. Did Moen recover faster because of their acquisition from Flow Technologies to Moen? Perhaps so. Or was it some other reason? You can conjecture. But it is a big deal from a company standpoint to go from having that contract and selling a lot of product, a ton, or to lose that contract. Second are the larger company-wide changes that have happened at FlowLogic, Finn, and Moen in this past year. As I mentioned in my last video, there are companies that fail in this space. In 2024, LeakSmart went out of business. In 2021, Residio's buoy was discontinued. Starting with FlowLogic, who has been around since 1996, they were acquired by Bradford White in 2024. Bradford White specializes in water heaters and other heating products. Their company was started in 1881 and their products are proudly made in the USA. FlowLogic is also made in the USA. Well, what happened? After almost 30 years, their founder, Chuck DeCement, justifiably wanted to retire. Congratulations, Chuck. From an outsider looking in, this looks like a match made in heaven where both companies invested in America and have a quality first mentality. They also have a job rec posted on LinkedIn for a marketing specialist. Apply now. This also means that they are actively growing, so FlowLogic will continue to be a player in this market. FinPlus also had a shakeup. In May of 2025, it was announced that they no longer are affiliated with Belkin and they have a new set of investors with a lead investor being Jonathan Scott. Hi, Jonathan. Hopefully this brings Finn some new momentum in the market. Moen also had a big announcement right at the beginning of the year. Their parent company, Fortune Brand Innovations, had a restructuring and pretty much gave an ultimatum to everyone at Moen headquarters, which was currently located in New Olmsted, Ohio, either moved to Deerfield, Illinois, which is a suburb of Chicago, or see ya. The transition is expected to end by the summer of 2026. While Moen Flow seems to be dominating the market at this point, you can buy it at Costco, at Amazon, of course their website. I've even seen display units. Um, that was in 2021 when I was at Ferguson and Central Arizona Supply, kind of wondering like, Hey, it's on the counter. Can people just buy that? But in any case, it's everywhere. And I'm not seeing those same display units for competitive devices. But for continuity reasons, I would expect that not everyone is going to make that move. And there's going to be some internal, just the normal forming, storming, norming that groups generally have when they're coming together with the new faces that are going to replace the people that didn't decide to move. For now, FlowLogic, Moen, and Finn look like they're pretty solid, but this is an important thing to consider when you're actually 
looking into buying a water monitor solution for this point and 11 other potential hidden costs when choosing the best water monitor to protect your home, check out this video next so that you are not caught by surprise.